Welcome to the Vectorize, my friends. I'm John Silva, and I'm here to teach you how you can use Affinity Designer in order to create the glitch effect. Exactly. I'm gonna show you the step by step in this uh, real time tutorial, and you're gonna see it right now. So the first step that you need to do it is to have a project that you're gonna create your mask effect. All right. So in order to do this, I have this project that I made for my Affinity student. If you are not my Affinity student, you can become a member right now. The link is gonna be available here on the description below where you can grab all my tutorials, all the lessons that I made with Affinity Designer for iPad and desktop. And in this lesson, you're gonna see uh, how you can create this effect that is called glitch effect, which means that you have some distortion over this image and also some channels changed by red and cyan to do that it's gonna be very simple i have here this project okay it is grouped what you need to do it is to create some rectangles above of it i'm gonna add these rectangles i'm just changing the color just to show you how this works i will place these rectangles right here i can move in order to change the size i'm gonna duplicate by pressing alt and shift and drag so you can have this result by duplicating. After you create all the rectangles, you just need to hold shift, click in the first one and then click in the last one. You just need to group, go here layer, group, and then give the name of glitch. So we're gonna have this result right now. After that, you just need to duplicate the project, all right? We're gonna duplicate the project below, going here to edit, duplicate selection. Keep in mind that you need to keep the project selected. Duplicated, good. After that, you just need to uh, press the right click on the glitch group and then click mask to below. What is gonna happen is that your glitch layer is gonna be placed inside of the mask position of that project. So you can move this a little bit to right or left, and then you're gonna have this result right here. But other than that, you can, uh, for example, release this mask here by clicking right click and then release mask. When you do that, you can simply move all the, the shapes, all right, just like this. And then select again the group if you want to mask by using this technique you just need to select hold and bring this inside of your project all right can you see that if you release here in the middle not below this needs to be applied on the middle here on the middle there we go you have the glitch effects again now what i'm gonna do it is to apply these colors here the way that i'm gonna teach you is very easy because we're gonna work with color overlay. To do that, I will duplicate again the layer that is below. Okay, duplicate by holding uh, Command or Shift or Alt or Shift if you are using Windows. In that case, I will apply the color overlay on the layer effects. Click Color Overlay, then apply the red color. Remember that you need to apply this color here below of your project's layer. Then you can duplicate to another side, click here layer effects, and then go to a blue color. And then you're gonna have this result. Also, if you want to increase even more, for example, we have the glitch effect, all right? You can simply group this layer, and then you can apply the outline effect in order to add even more stroke if you want. And there we go. You got a very nice glitch effect using Affinity Designer. Remember that uh, to make this happen, you need to mask the glitch effects inside of the first layer project. So that's it for now. All right, my friend, if you have enjoyed this lesson, please join the club because on there you're gonna learn a lot with all my tutorials. We have more than 200 tutorials already, and I'm so excited to show you how you can use Affinity Designer like no one else. So I'm very happy to see you on my club. And if you have questions, please just comment here below. I'm very ha uh, happy and excited to 
answer your questions so see you on there take care and bye bye